So we're here at uh, Rio Sense. So who are you? Uh, my name is Grace, and I am in marketing with Rio Sense. My name is Lulu, and I'm a technical specialist at Rio Sense. So what does Rio Sense do? We make viscometers, uh, which measure viscosity, also known as the resistance to flow. So uh, what are you showing here? Yeah. So. Um, this is one of our instruments. This is the viscometer, uh, MV Rock viscometer, um, known for its small samples and accuracy. Uh, this is more of a lab bench and R&D instrumentation, uh, and it's controlled by a pump system. So, so this is the viscometer on a chip that you have, right? Yes. So, so what is this? Yeah, um, it stands for viscometer rheometer on a chip, formerly known as V Rock. It is RioSense's patented technology, um, and this is what powers all our viscometers. Uh, if you notice on the back, there's four pressure sensors, and that is what measures the change in pressure as your liquid or sample flows through. All right, so that's the chip, that's, the, that's your product, and yes. it's in this machine here? Yes. So let's check it out. Yeah, so this is the MVROC viscometer, uh, more of a lab bench. What you do is you load your sample, so we just have some water uh, detergent solution here. And we connect it to the chip. Once it's secure, you just place it in. And you um, tighten up the pump. And it's connected to the computer? Yes. Um, so this instrument, or a viscometer, connects to the computer and communicates with the computer. Um, this software is capable of shear rate and temperature sweeps. We will begin our first measurement. So my colleague Lou is actually placing in the measurement parameters right now. You can place a sample ID, uh, you can kind of guess the estimated viscosity. This feature is um, kind of optional, so if you do not know the viscosity, don't panic. Um, sample volume, so sample volume is the amount of sample that is currently in your syringe. And you can customize and select the shear rate or flow rate at which you want the pump to flow. So what's going to happen now? Um, so Lou actually just made the pump kind of detect the syringe. Um, so now that it's detected, uh, we can go ahead and start the measurement. Now Lou press start, so the viscosity measurement will now take place. So the the, the liquid will go into your chip? Yes. Or through it or touch it or how does it do? Yeah, so the liquid is actually introduced into the inlet, um, and as stated before, yeah. there are four there are four pressure sensors inside, uh, so the liquid will flow through each pressure sensor, and the sensor will detect the change in pressure. So this is important for the uh, printer electronics, right? Yeah, um, ink applications, uh, graphene inks, all types. And uh, people want to know uh, the viscosity, and it's important. Yes. Yeah. Uh, formulation or quality control for all the parts of the process during inkjet ink and coating and conducting inks. Now, uh, viscosity is an important parameters to control the quality of the ink and if it is good ink or bad ink.